But just be honest, there's some of us that do this that would turn this job back in because it's not ideal. But we do it all, man. This crew ain't scared of much. And that's a good thing. There's a lot of scary crews out here. You see a job like this? They're like, no way. We're like, okay. We're gonna do what we gotta do to make a living. That's what I mean by man work. We're not gonna make no excuses about why it cannot be done unless it cannot be done. Episode four. How'd I catch you around this part of town? Hey man, you better take a second to like the video, comment, let us know what you think. We out here working. Believe it or not, this is my favorite part of the job, man. Working in the easement. Sound like I'm fronting, but if any, you ask anybody that know me, they'll tell you. This is my favorite part of the job. Cause this right here separates the men from the boys. A lot of guys love them buckets. You placer boys, you love them placers. Come on back here in the woods with me. Let me see what you're really about. I'll never be like you real lineman. But God damn it, I play one on TV. That's for damn sure. Pull the strand. I got guys in the middle, a guy at the beginning. Just came through all this bullshit, jigging, throwing the rope, coming through, throwing the rope. Jumping the two lines up there. Jumping back over. It's friction all through here. Which makes it even harder than what it is. But we got it done. The one thing you don't hear is no complaining. You hear some tiredness in me, some heavy breathing. But you don't hear no complaining. Cause it's real linemen don't get to complain. Oh my fault. Because us fake linemen don't get to complain. There's my guys, you can see them as we're coming up. Where they are versus where I was at. They're pulling string. I know, I know. We should have some type of machine back here to help us so we can become real linemen. I think we damn near got enough. I'm going to check the map. I know I'm up at least four spans from here. I done jigged it through the trees. I'm way the fuck up there over here. Yeah, we working, man. And this is the beginning. We still got to jack the strand up. And then we got to come back through and jig the fiber. If I was thinking, I would have jigged it right behind the strand. But I ain't been in the field every day like these guys. I've been lacking. I didn't think about it till we got halfway through it. I'm like, why not pull in the fiber right behind this strand? One run, one time. Well, twice, but it is what it is. I need some exercise. I'll take it. Getting paid to exercise. I'll take it. Right now, I can't even lie, I got a good crew, man. Right now, I got a decent set of guys out here with me. We working through this. And hopefully, if you on the crew, it's the cool people that love this shit. Because it makes it a lot easier to get the days through. When you know you're out here with other people, it's gonna give you what you give them, 100%. You know, slackers, if everybody's slacking, I guess that works out too. But if you got a crew of go-getters, it makes this job a lot easier, man. It makes you actually like the job even more. <laughs> says the boss. We didn't make a splicer truck. Or are those power trucks? Yeah. Hey, to be stuck in the office, the old man's still pretty good slaying that rope. Just like the good old days of slinging that iron. <laughs>
Go Lasher!